Welcome to another hard hitting Biden. Oh. video from Snook Christian Academy. Have a great day. Sneaks up and sniffs it, sniffs it, and then says, I'm going to take a bite. And oh, no, 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 no. a way of what? There's a way of escape, there's a way out of every temptation. So, what I did was I got a little too close and I realized, you know what, I shouldn't have done this. I need to get out of this situation. I said something hurtful, I shouldn't have done that. I, I took something I shouldn't have. The Bible says there's a way of escape there's a way of escape sometimes that's uh that's apologizing sometimes that's owning it there's a way out of every temptation just because you do something wrong doesn't mean you have to continue to do something wrong here's the deal as long as you keep your hand flat you're going to be good you ready okay you trust me it's good it's good all right don't move it all right she's in the trap okay there was a part of presley that was a little pulled to the bait okay and she, des she decided she got a little too close. But God said he would provide a way of escape in every temptation. Sometimes that way of escape, you good? Don't move your hand. Keep your fingers, keep your fingers up. Just like that. Sometimes that way of escape is you need to pray. Sometimes that way of escape is you need to have somebody encourage you. Help you see through how do I get out of this situation. You see, sometimes when we get caught up in sin, we go, there's no way out. There's nothing I can do. And so we just dive farther and farther into it. But that's not true. There's always a way out. There is always hell. Because God promised he is faithful. He will always provide a way of escape. You just have to look for it. Okay? You never have to give in to the temptation. There's always a way out. You ready? We're going to get out of this trap. On the count of three. Count it for us. Ready? Go. One, One two, two, three. three. Are you hurt? No. Show him your hand. You good? Give him a round of applause. Good job. Good job. Together just like this. We're going to find out. You ready? Just trust me. Just trust me. Layla, would I hurt Lydia? Would I hurt her? No. You can do it. Hold your hands just like this. I already did it. This is my last one. Straight. You ready? All right, we're stuck now, Olivia. There's only one way out of this thing, okay? We're stuck. Now, what's happened? What's happened is Olivia decided she actually took the bait, okay? But she doesn't want to be in this bad situation anymore, do you? All right, so sometimes we have to trust God that when he says there's a way of escape, there's a way of escape. Keep your hands completely straight, okay? You nervous? Yeah, she's pretty nervous. Can you see it? All right, we're going to count. We're going to count to three. You ready, Olivia? One, two, three. Oh, are you okay? All right, she's good. Give her another call. Ready? One, two, three. Oh. Stop. All right, so the top part is yours. If you'll take that. Now, I want you to show them the card. I'm going to look over here. <laughs> okay. Now, what are some of the things that make you forget about Jesus? What are some of the things in life that make us forget? Anyone got one? Raise your hand. Sometimes our stuff and our toys get in our way. We think more about our toys than we do Jesus. What's something else? Jesus is going to come out on top no matter what. Okay? So I want you to watch this. You're going to squeeze these cards. I don't know what card is what. And when you hit the one that comes out should be a five, right? Is that was that Jesus? Yes. Is that the card she showed you? Yes. No. That's the card I showed y'all. That's the card I showed y'all. So I want you to remember. I want you to remember that no matter what happens, no matter what we're going through, no matter what piles on us in life, who comes out on top? God and Jesus. Our relationship always wins. So I want you to remember that. And when you think about magic, think about card tricks, remember that Jesus always wins.
Sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life in Christ Jesus our Lord. Um, our fun fact for the day squirrels cause approximately 10 to 20 percent of all U.S. power outages. On this day in history, in 1947, the World Series is broadcasted on TV for the first time. Here's our joke of the day Stop looking for the perfect match, use a lighter. Please pray with me. Lord, thank you for this day and all that you've done for us. Please help the Schaefer family through the hard times that they're going, Lord, and please help there just to be there for them. And please help us just have a good day and to always remember you, Lord. Amen. Let's make it a great day, Eagles. We'd like to wish happy birthday today to a limited ward. Our fun fact for the day, the original name for Google was Backrub. On this day in history, in 1928, penicillin is discovered. Hey Tommy, what kind of drink can be bitter and sweet? No clue. Reality. Uh, submitted by me. <laughs> All right, let's pray. Dear Lord, we thank you for once again a great day. We pray for safety and for your blessing throughout the day. We pray that your will be done, and we thank you for all the many blessings you've given to us. In your son Jesus and the sacrifice you made for us. In his name we pray, amen. Let's make it a great day, Eagles. Let's go. Bible verse is James 4 7. Submit yourselves therefore to God, resist the devil, and he will flee from you.
Favorite Bible verse is Proverbs 8, 11. For wisdom is better than rubies, and all the things one may desire cannot compare with her. And her favorite Bible verse is Philippians 4, 6 through 7. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. And the peace of God which passes all understanding will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Lexi said her goal for this year is to be the stronger, better person to those around her and to be a light in this world. Gabby has many goals for her senior year, including making straight A's. The Snook Christian Academy 2021 Homecoming Queen is... Miss Lexi Parker! Videoing this as evidence that we love and care for you. Tell them your teacher appreciates coffee, doesn't she? She does. She does. She does. She does. She does. So you have the very first cup of a very new coffee maker. <laughs> From the bottom of my heart, all teachers know Jesus and coffee is the fuel. Well, we gave you the first one out of the pot.